Chris from 40 Thrive here in Century Park in Lorain, Ohio. And I just had a little bit of advice to talk to you about today. You know, some of you have very structured lives. Some of you know how to budget your time wisely. And so maybe this advice might not be for you. But some of us don't have that kind of lifestyle. Uh, some of us, our lives are very unpredictable. We're constantly getting hit with waves of tasks and priorities and um, it's really hard to try and map out your day. Uh, we have a general idea of what we want to get done for that day, but we get distracted. Uh, you know, uh, we kind of get hit with these uh, with these unpredictable situations. Sorry, I'm gonna try and keep myself in frame here. I already did my cold plunge, or, uh, not cold plunge, cold shower for today. I got my workout in. My arm's not getting tired from holding this phone because this is my fourth take. I'm not starting to shiver uncontrollably. That's not happening. Um, but um, now I'm out here getting my sunlight, even though it is kind of an overcast day. And so that's why I just wanted to stress the importance, especially for those of you that have sort of a uh, unpredictable lifestyle. You know, I don't know about the rest of you, but for the most part, other than my employees and a handful of friends and family members, um, I pretty much manage my life on my own uh, between raising a son, between managing a business, um, and just overall just trying to go through life. You know, it's just me. Um, so it's important for me to make sure I carve out at least one hour of my day to do the things that are going to benefit me. Um, those things making sure I eat right, making sure I work out, making sure I get um, my exercise in and get my get my daily dose of some outdoor activity, some kind of sunlight. Because honestly, those are the most important things. Anything else, if the rest of the day goes to pot, at least I've done those things for me. And just by doing those things, <sighs> your arm's tired, my arm's not tired. Um, just by doing those things, um, you're automatically going to have more success in the types of um, tasks and the types of, uh, you know, obligations that you get hit with throughout the day. So uh, make sure you are at least taking at least 15 to 20 minutes for yourself, if not an hour. Um, you know, some of us have uh, a little more time to spare than others, but... Um, yeah, I just thought this would be a nice opportunity to kind of show you. I, I know I, I tend to kind of stay at home <clears throat> whenever I'm doing these videos. Sometimes I hit up a park. But I tend to forget I'm right here by the lake, and it's beautiful, and I really should take more advantage of it. Um, it, is, it is absolutely gorgeous out here, even, even when it's cold. I mean, it's just amazing to kind of witness the, the strength and the force of the lake and the cold. You know, you got that ice floating on the surface there. Sometimes the lake's completely frozen over. You can see the accumulation of all, all these blocks of ice. I mean, it's, 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 it's a frozen solid chunk of ice. I tried to walk out on it and I was like, yeah, this is where they find me dead. Local brewer dies of concussion out on the lake. All right, well, that was my video. It was a great video. My coffee's getting cold. That's okay. So cheers. I hope you guys keep on thriving. I really hope you're doing everything you can for yourselves. Everything to um, motivate yourself. Keep pushing yourself. You can push through anything. I'm telling you, I've been doing these cold showers now for the past week. And, you know, the first one, that was the hardest one. I, I shivered for at least a good two hours after the shower. There's a there's a rock over here. It's kind of shaped like a star. Hold on a second. Is it? Oh, that's my finger. There it is. Look at that. It's a little star. It's a star. If I was with my son's rocks that I would be picking up and I'd save it and I kind of have like a collection of stones at my house. Each one attached to a little memory with my son. Um, that's one of the most amazing things I have going on in my life right now is, is raising this little boy. It's bittersweet because, you know, every, every day he gets a little bit bigger. And that's, that's, you know, 
it's my, my baby disappearing on me, but uh, I'm a lucky guy. But anyway, I just want to tell you, you can push through anything. And if you haven't started on some kind of routine to help discover your potentials, just take little steps. You can do it. I promise you. I started this journey off, I was working out with just a 15 pound medicine ball. And where it's taken me, I never thought I could ever, ever endure what I'm going through right now. So don't be afraid to put yourself in an uncomfortable situation at least once a day for at least two minutes a day. Put yourself in an uncomfortable situation. You'd be surprised how resilient you are. So with that, cheers. Keep thriving.